everybody. This is 365 Days of Movie, a series where I rate my top 365 movies of all time. So, I'm going to release one video a day in which I talk about a movie on the list, and one year later we'll have an entire list that goes from 365 down to one. If you have any opinions on the movies, let me know. I'd love to discuss it. Also, if you're interested in a deeper review of the movie, or maybe even a full video essay, the more interest I get in it, the more likely I am to do it. So I'd love to discuss this stuff with you in the comments. Comment below. Number 209, Airplane 2, the sequel. Rating, 7.92. It came out in 1982, directed by Ken Finkelman. Starring Robert Hayes, Julie, ha Julie Haggerty, Lloyd Bridges, Chad Everett, William Shatner. Though haunted by combat memories, heroic pilot Ted Stryker returns to the cockpit uh, to man the controls of Mayflower 1, America's first commercial spacecraft. But as soon as Mayflower 1 lifts off, an electric malfunction sends the ship veering off course. A shaken striker struggles to guide the shuttle through a treacherous asteroid belt, tame its failing computer systems, and stop the disgruntled Joe Salucci from detonating a deadly bomb on board. Now, the airplane movies are just awesome. And they are roll-on-the-floor laugh events. So, I think that uh, everyone should be checking them out uh, because they're just hilarious. Now, most of their humor is based on either misunderstandings of language um, or uh, taking things literally and uh, that, that, kind of, that kind of humor, puns. So it's not uh, the kind of humor, you know, from the early 2000s, late 2010s, you know, those, ki those kinds of movies. Uh, this is a sort of, it keeps the joke going and keeps using the same style of joke in a new situation with new, I guess, props or individuals, but it's still hilarious and you should check it out. Hey everybody, this has been 365 Days of Movies. We're going to keep plowing ahead. So let me know what you think of this movie, and if you want to discuss it further, comment below. If I get a lot of interest, I may very well make a full review of the movie, maybe even a video essay. So let me know what you think, and let's get to the next one.